Okay, so you're a little bit, I would, I would uh, fine tune it, like maybe two more fingers. You're wrapping the opposite direction than I would. There you go, now go, now go, there you go. There you go, now you go. Um, if you, the way you were doing it, just sometimes it, when you wrap it around your fingers, it's, it's a little bit odd. All right, let's go ahead, and I would choke up a little bit more. She has too much leash. I would go, well, there you go. That still might be a little bit too much leash, but let's see how she does. You want to make it too, too tense, but we just don't want it to be too loose because then she's going to go in front of you, behind you, and all over the place. It's like, why are you using this? And just walk at your normal pace. Don't worry about her. If she lags, let your arm go relaxed. It's a beautiful day in Brentwood. So again, the correction is a quick jerk up. Don't stop for her. Now, if you want to stop wherever you want, that's fine. It's her job to match your pace, not the other way around. That was a good correction. Now try to do the correction without stopping next time. Now this gentleman that's up here that we're gonna encounter, is that somebody she would normally bark at? Okay, so we're gonna walk and we're gonna watch. When you get close, when you get about seven feet of him, I want you to watch her. If she starts to bark, I want you to hiss and correct with the leash just like we did before. How does this compare to normal? She's, uh, you have more, more control? A lot more control, yeah. Now we took our time before we left, so we started out with her in a balanced state of mind. Now she's starting to stare a little bit, and she looked away, so that's good. I want to see another dog. <laughs> one thing at a time. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we'll find another one. And don't pause, just walk casually next. How you doing? How are you doing? Good. What's that? I am a dog behaviorist. She normally would be barking her head off at you. <laughs> so, right? Correct? Yeah. I would say like 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10 people she barks by, at? Right? So, we took our time before we left, so she's in a more balanced state of mind. And then we're keeping her next to you rather than in front. And this is the martingale with a special twist of leash. So this helps her feel like you have more control. So it's easier for her to give up on control because you've got the tools and you're acting like a leader to her. All right, do you want to, let's uh, swap out partners so I can have a little video of you doing it as well. So go, uh, no, put it all the way around your wrist. Oh. Now, now go, uh, nope, now go up towards, there you go. Perfect. Perfect, good, that, good length, that, okay. their length looks good. All right, we have another gentleman, looks like a parking or construction guy or somebody. He, now he's walking, he's got a little bit of a good gait. So let's go a little bit faster. I want to get across the street so we can walk next to this guy. She is also, uh, Let's hurry up, hurry up. I want to get across the street. This guy, his gait, I'm pretty sure, will come, uh, would be more of a response to that gate. So I want to take advantage of our scenery if we can. Uh, actually, let's we'll just follow him. Okay, so why don't you wait here? Perfect. All right, keep going. Now, we have some gardeners, which is the guy that we're following up here. He's carrying some branches, but they have some equipment. There we go. Good correction. Try to do it without stopping. And she can go again to the side. We don't care about the side. We just care about the front. That was a great correction. Your timing was great. Let's uh, give me one second. Can you shake those? Can we walk by when you shake those? Just that we, we just want to walk by and have you shake them. Shake them. Perfect. All right, let's go ahead and try it again. So when the dog walks by, just shake it. Perfect. 
Jake, keep going, keep going, don't stop. So that startled her, perfecto, gracias, come now. So that startled her, normally that would have been a barking reaction, right? Yeah, probably. So again, you're next to her, not, she's next to you instead of in front of you, and you correct it with good timing. Don't stop for her. Oh. It's a habit, you're not even yeah. realize how yeah. often you do it. That was great, your timing was good, your correction looked good. So this is basically, just make sure you keep your arms straight, go the way straight down unless you're correcting, and that's just a fraction of a second while you're correcting. Sonny, you're looking good.